Hey friends, welcome back. Today in this video, we will solve this algebraic problem and it is 8 power by x minus 2 power by x divided by 6 power by x minus 3 power by x that is equal to 2 where x is an integer and find the value of x. So friend, by looking the expression of left hand side, we can say that if we will put the value of x is equal to 1, this will satisfy this equation because 8 power by 1, so here it is 1, so it will be 8 minus 2 power by 1 will be 2 and divided by 6 power by 1 is 6 minus 3 power by 1 is 3 that is equal to 2 here and now it is 8 minus 2 is 6 that is divided by 6 minus 3 that is 3 so the value of this term will be 2 so when one solution of this expression will be x is equal to 1 so we'll try for another solution of this expression so let's start so 8 we can write as 2 cube and its power is x and minus 2 to the power x divided by here it is 6 we will write 2 times 3 and it is powered by x minus 3 powered by x is equal to in the right hand side we have 2 so now we will multiply the power so we can write it as 2 powered by 2 powered by 3x minus 2 powered by x that is divided by so here we will split the multiplication value so we can write 2 powered by x times 3 powered by x minus 3 powered by x here and that is equal to 2 now from the numerator we will take 2 powered by x common so 2 powered by x we can take common from the numerator so if we will take 2 powered by x common the remaining here is 2 powered by 2x because we have taken 1x common so remaining is 2x and that is subtracted by 1 here and divided by now from the denominator we can take 3 powered by x common 3 powered by x common so it is 3 powered by x if we will take common the remaining here is 2 powered by x 2 powered by x and minus here it is 1 and that is equal to 2 now the next step now here 2 powered by 2x so it is 2 powered by 2x we can write it as 2 powered by x and its whole square so it is in the form of a square minus b square and the formula of a square minus b square is a plus b times a minus b so here it is a is 2 powered by x so it is 2 powered by x so we can write the numerator as 2 powered by x and here a plus b means 2 powered by x plus 1 and multiplied by 2 powered by x minus 1 and in the denominator we have 3 powered by x 3 powered by x multiplied by 2 powered by x minus 1 and equal to 2 now we can cancel 2 powered by x minus 1 in the numerator and denominator for the value of 2 powered by x 2 powered by x minus 1 should not be equal to 0 now here 2 powered by x should not be equal to we will take 1 in the right hand side it will be plus 1 so for the value of 2 powered by x 1 we can write as 2 powered by 0 so here the value of x should not be equal to 0 so x should not be equal to 0 now we will further simplify and here we have base 2 and here also it is base 2 and powered by 1 so we will write 2 in the denominator so we can write 2 powered by x multiplied by 2 powered by x plus 1 so here we have written this value and it is divided by 2 so we will write 2 and that will be equal to we will take this 3 powered by x in the right hand side so it is 3 powered by x so here it is powered by 1 so friend, now we will simplify it it is 2 powered by x and in the denominator we have powered by 1 so it will be 2 powered by x minus 1 and it is multiplied by 2 powered by x and we have plus 1 and that is equal to that is equal to 3 powered by x now for calculating the value of x we will compare this expression so friend, now we will calculate the value of x by putting the value first of all we will put the values x is greater than or equal to 2 now here it is mentioned that x is an integer so here we will assume x is greater than 2 so if the value of x will be greater than 2 then the value of this term will be even even and the value of this term it is plus by 1 so any even value is plus by 1 will be odd number and here we have even and odd and multiplication of even and odd will always be an even number 
so the value of the left hand side whole expression value will be an even number only now the value of right hand side it is 3 powered by x and x is more than 2 then the value of this term will be odd only odd only so the value of x is equal to or more than 2 does not satisfy this expression so we cannot take any value of x which is greater than 2 now we'll take the value of x is equal to 1 so x is equal to 1 now if we'll put x as 1 so this value this value will be 2 powered by 1 minus 1 is 0 multiplied by 2 powered by 1 so 2 powered by 1 plus 1 and that is equal to 3 powered by x is 1 so it is 2 powered by 0 is 1 times 2 and 1 is 3 and that is equal to 3 so left hand side we have 3 and 1 is 3 and equal to 3 so this satisfies this expression so we can take x is equal to 1 so here we have calculated x is 2 or more than 2 and here it is x is 1 now for the integer value we'll take x is negative value so for negative value and now we'll calculate for negative value let us take x is equal to negative n where n is more than equal to 1 now for further solution we'll erase this so it is 2 power by negative n minus 1 and it is multiplied by multiplied by 2 power by negative n plus 1 and that is equal to 3 power by negative n so here it is 2 power by negative n and negative 1 so we can write 1 over 2 power by n plus 1 and here it is 2 power by negative n we can write it as 1 over 2 power by n and it is plus 1 so plus 1 and that is equal to 3 power by negative 1 similarly we can write 1 over 3 power by n now we'll simplify this we can write it as 1 over 2 power by n plus 1 and multiply it by and this value we can write as 2 power by 2 power by n plus 1 and that is divided by 2 power by n and that is equal to 1 over 3 power by n now in the numerator we'll multiply it we'll multiply the numerator it is 2 power by n plus 1 and in the denominator we have 2 power by n and 2 power by n so we can write 2 power by 2n plus 1 and that is equal to 1 over 3 power by n now for further solutions we will write in the next page so now for further solution we will cross multiply it it is 2 power by n plus 1 and it is multiplied by 3 power by n that is equal to here in the right hand side it is 2 power by 2n plus 1 so here again we will compare the left hand side and right hand side as per the even and odd values so here we have 2 power by n for any value of n this value will be even number and even number is added by 1 so the value of this whole term will be odd number and 3 power by n will be any odd number only so it is odd and the multiplication of 2 odd and odd is odd only so the value of this left hand side expression value is odd so now in the right hand side we have 2 power by any value let it be any value the value of 2 power by any value will be even only even only so in the left hand side we have odd and in the right hand side we have even so we cannot accept the value of n as a negative number the value of x should not be less than or equal to 0 so in this expression we have calculated first is x is more than or equal to 2 this does not satisfy this expression next is x is equal to 1 x is equal to 1 it is satisfying this expression and the third is x is any negative number means x is less than 1 this also does not satisfy this expression so we have only one solution that is x is equal to 1 so fan if still you have not subscribed my channel please do subscribe for more exciting videos thank you for watching the video